used to think that I was a fine enough And I used to think that I wasn't wild enough But I won't waste my time trying to figure out Why you playing games, what's this all about? And I can't believe you're hurting me I met your girl, what a difference What you see in her, you ain't seen in me But I guess it was just make believe Oh, love Never knew what I was missing But I knew once we start kissing I found Keisha Cole, everybody Keisha Cole What's going on, party people? What is going on? It's your ride share extraordinaire, your super duper Uber drivers here, guys. Thank you. Thank you. You part too kind. You guys, you already know the deal. Before you hop in my ride, do me a favor. Hit the like. Hit that subscribe. Poor favor. <laughs> Come on, let's do this. Hop on in. Buckle in. And let's go. All right, Ken folks, party people. Thank you for coming back. And if you're new to my channel, thank you for hitting that subscribe button. What are we talking about today, folks? What are we talking about today? Cougar alert. Cougar alert. Man, what is going on with these young ladies? We have Keisha Cole, another hopeless romantic who just can't get right. All these R&B singers, ugh, they talk about love, they sing about love, and they can't find love. The irony. Man, oh man. So, Kichiko, truth be told, I was I always had a little crush on her. That little gap that she had before she got her, her dentures done. Man, she just should have kept the gap. But ever since then, man, you know, she got a big head. She thought she's all that. She goes around and she never date nobody her age or above. It's always a young men. Man, she dated, uh, I think she dated Antonio Brown. He's like five, six, seven years younger. He dated, uh, this other guy. Look at this guy's name. He was like 17 years younger than like, God damn, Keisha, you can't find nobody your age. And now she's dating this guy, Huncho. Another one. And, you know, he's a rapper, I guess. And she just loved these rappers. And, golly, if Pookie was a female, that'd be Keisha Cole. I hate to say wow. it. Wow. She's a straight. She don't know how to pick men. All her men got to be something in the industry, a young thug or something. You know, she's just poor at picking men. So she was dating this guy. And, you know, he's in the streets and, he got other females and they fighting over him. Uh, just a mess. Just a mess. And Keisha, you too old for this. How old are you now? 41, 42, something like that. Are you still dealing with boys? Oh man. So now that you're of this age, I see why nobody want to deal with you. Cause again, you have a track record of picking bad men. And what are they going to get out of this? A 42 year old, uh, R&B diva. Ooh, nobody wants to deal with that, man. Seriously. And he, uh, instead of just stay away from it, you know, but you got to have it. You have to have it. Sugar baby. Become sugar mama. Drizzle, drizzle. Yeah, Keisha, you got to pay for these attention. And that's that's pretty bad because you're an attractive young lady. But nobody want to deal with you. Nobody want to deal with you because, again, of your track record of picking poor men. Antonio Brown, oh, my goodness. That's saying that he's a, I'm just saying, mentally, he's not all there. Everybody knows this about Antonio Brown. And um, you just want to be in the spotlight too bad. You're in the spotlight too bad. Your career is starting to dwindle down. Um, your kids are about to be grown. 
and you still over here chasing. What is wrong with you? It's not even, it's not even love anymore. You, it doesn't pass beyond love because you're too old to be in love. But you got this fantasy of, man, I don't know what's wrong with you ladies, man. We have all these cougars out here. I did one about Vivica Fox. I did one about Mary J. Blige. This is the same thing with y'all. Now, this guy is about, what, 14, 15 years younger than you, and you want to, you know what you remind me of? There's this teacher, and, uh, well, I want to say a teacher. He's a, she was a daycare worker that, um, was there in Clayton County. She was 24 years old, 24 years old, and she had a relationship with a 10 year old boy. Concerns for after a couple of instances at the place where her son attends this after school program, but she went to plug in his phone to charge it, and that's when she discovered what was going on between her 10 year old and a worker here at this daycare, the Youth Life Center, that had more than crossed the line. And she's uncovered that that relationship that had been brewing for likely weeks. They hugged for a lengthy period of time. Grace Awelu thought something was off with a newer worker here at Youth Life Center on Valley Hill Road. But when she plugged in her son's phone, her face was his screensaver on the phone. And it was a picture that she had taken of herself. And she started digging. I went through his text messages because that was the first thing that I thought. And her name was saved in his phone as mommy. And it's a bunch of I love yous and what are you wearing? She shared pictures of much of the concerning conversation between her son and the 24-year-old worker and pictures like no. this one. That's not a picture that you send to a 10-year-old. That's a picture that you send to your man. She said the worker bought her son clothes, shoes, and even a gold chain. And Grace said when investigators came to her apartment, a Department of Family and Children's Services worker got her 10-year-old to reveal more. He did say that this incident where she was rubbing his leg happened on the way back from the field trip. 14 years difference, right? What's the difference? What's the difference, Keisha? You tell me. Oh, this guy is a man? Oh, okay. Y'all want to do this because men could do it too is your whole argument. If men could do it, I could do it too. You want to be even with a man. You want to make sure that you get yours. If a man can do it, you believe you could do it too. Man, it doesn't work that way, but you're going to find out. Because, again, you're 42, and you're closer to 50 than, <laughs> than, uh, than 35. And once you hit that 50 mark, ain't nobody be checking for you. You have to pull up that checkbook. Now, can I get a drizzle, drizzle? <laughs> drizzle, drizzle. You remind me of a, uh, of a predator right now. And it's pretty bad. Vivica Fox, the same thing. Y'all just need to grow up. You done mismanage your youth. You done mismanage your, your, your looks. You was trying to cash in and get the big bank and you lost. You lost at love. Admit it. You lost at love. Now that you lost at love, just take your little winnings, take your little money that you got and go find a hut and just stay there and be quiet. Be somebody's mama. Be somebody's grandmother. Okay. Cause again, it, it's over far as love. Now, you want somebody to blow your back out, that's different. You want somebody to take out the trash and kill spiders, that's different. But you're looking for love, there's no such thing for your age. Knock it off. Man, this is disheartening trying to see you old broads looking for love. Anyway. Well, good luck, baby girl. What the hell do I know? If you guys got any value out of my content, do me a favor. Hit the like. Hit that subscribe. You see that notification bell? Turn on that notification bell so you get my latest and greatest. Share this content with your best friends. Tell your mama I said hi. <laughs> drizzle, drizzle. All right, guys. Till next time, I'll see you again. And all you knuckleheads, get off my lawn.